Hey guys, it's Blur Riley back with another video. I know it's been a hot minute since I released a Giants franchise video, but I wanted to take a little break from these guys and mess around on uh, uh, something different. So this is what our team is looking like, if you guys forgot. Um, Kirkland, I think, is Superstar Dove, maybe Star. Dudley Little though is Superstar. I don't know why like, he's so far down. Aunt Penny to Pan Perry, our second middle linebacker, because he is star. And yeah. Rushing right on. Yeah, it works. That works. Okay, all this works. Good, good. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Let's get into week two of the regular season as we no longer have Daniel Jones. We have a rookie quarterback and something like Ross or something like that. I think, no. I don't know what our own quarterback's name is. That's how long I've been away from this. Guys, and just so you know, my school's starting up soon, so, Welcome like, everybody. literally tomorrow. So, I'll only really be able to post Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. I might be able to get some off on the week, but, yeah. Hope you guys understand if I can't. Am I on all Madden still? I just want to make sure. Game options, all Madden. Okay, good. So this is probably gonna be my last video until like Friday. Yeah, running a cover six gap, or I don't know, whatever it's called, and they run it first play on them, and they get you know play action. They have Zach Ertz wide open sideline grab. First down, Zach Ertz. The lead. The man who broke the record last year for most catches in a year, and he didn't drop a catch actually, I think. Which is actually like really cool. As that is Kirkland on the tackle, taking down Sanders at the 44 yard line for only four yard left. Run it again, and he just gets right by me. CJ Procise with the pickup of, with the first down, eight yard rush. Pinch the line. And it's, put some pressure on that. A nice job by Dexter Warren to get off the, to get off his blocker and take him down for a loss of, on for. No game. As I try to hit stick him, but that works too. And we put him back to two yards. Let's go. To blow peppers with a big hit. Our bounds on to Zach Ertz. I am happy of this. Pick by Miles Jack as user work easy reads. I wanted to be, be on Zach Ertz and Zach Ertz only as it's still on all man. You guys saw it. A safe on Barkley gets a nice run off the RPO for eight yards. Let's go. And that's big that we picked him, picked off um, Carson Wentz this early in the game because, yeah, it's just big because we didn't let them score. 30 inches, boy. And Saquon power through. Saquon Barkley picks up the first three straight carries in a row. I think that he got good work on them, so as well. Keep getting the man the ball as this is going to be the first throwing play for Kendall on the day. And we're gonna hit Evan Ingram, I think. Oh, no, we aren't going to hit Evan Ingram as he just popped that one up in the air. 
I should have gone for pretty much so anything other than that, but I just wasn't too sure. I'm going to go back to the running game on this play, and Saquon Barkley only gets a gain of three on the play. And we are looking to get a first down here, obviously, but we might not get a first down here. And oh my god, that ball is well overthrown. He had Preston Williams wide open. If I plant my feet, I should have probably just thrown a bullet pass because we had Preston Williams open for days. Well, yeah, we can't convert any on the pick, and I'm going to be in motion here as the running back Sanders gets uh, no gain. And I would think that he would go back in yardage, but forward progress, so yeah. he doesn't, he stays where he is. And I missed the big hit, but Kirkland on the tackle for a gain of two uh, by Carson Wentz, as there is a false start on the play. Oh, and an encroachment. So now it will be third and three. Kareem Martin with the encroachment. Nice job, guys. They might run it here, but I'm not too sure. I'm just gonna pinch anyway. Yep, he always goes to the it's on third end. That's what I was trying to get to, but carries a little too slow. And that's a first down. Zach Ertz with the game, with the pickup. And we're all right, you can so. And Slayton just gets burned. <laughs> the, I could have gotten the tackle, but I got destroyed, and Jabril Peppers gets a tackle after a big game from Pro Slice. Gives that man the start <laughs> if he's running like that. Oh no, I wanted to pop in, as that might be Paul Richardson. Oh no, it's all I don't know who that is. But big game nonetheless for number 10, Deshaun Jackson, really. He's back on the Eagles apparently. As that is going to be uh, Isaiah Perry making up for the play where he you wants know, Zach to get the reception. And as he gets the tackle at four loss. Nice job. Can we get another tackle with Isaiah Perry? He's getting work right now. Tackles him for a five yard game. After a five yard game. And that's going to end off the first quarter as it is zero to zero. Our defense is holding their own right now. Oh, I get Miles Jack and get this cover, Zach Ertz. Anyway. Nice tackle by. Mr. Slate and I oh, know that's BJ Hill on the main tackle and then Dudley Will comes over and ends for the um, confirmed tackle, I guess I could call it. They'll kick their field goal and that might be off if the wind's not there, but it is good, hits the bottom corner, hits the bottom left corner. As the Eagles go up three to nothing at the beginning of the second quarter. I'm proud of the defense so far. We've been holding our own as I just fair catch that in the end zone. Not even gonna bother returning. And here we go, boys, come on. Kendall threw a pick last time we were out, but you know, he puts that away very fast. And oh God, I did not realize that Fletcher Cox and Brandon Graham were lined up on the same side. That's my bad, I guess you could say. Kendall dropping back in the pocket. Gonna hit, hold it. No, oh my god, Tyree Kill drops the ball after getting hit by Brandon Brooks, I want to say. I'm only around well, like 16 yards, I think. No, very no boom. Whoa, well, okay. Where's the pass interference call there? Literally ran in front of me, but whatever. We're gonna punt it down. That should be down. Oh god, that's it. Well, I probably could have put Max Power on that. I forgot that Riley Dick Dixon isn't a good um, picker. So, yeah, I forgot about that. I could have put way more power on that, but Miles Jack is who we're using. They run the ball. 
as he goes nowhere. That is Kendall four on the tackle for a loss. <laughs> nice job, guys. I'm, out, I'm using Mel Jack and then just cover the heck out of Zach Hurts in this play. Yeah, take your dump down to Deshaun Jackson for a, only gain, for a gain of two on the play. Oh, I need to get on to Miles Jack and then, yeah. We're just going to completely press. Into, oh my god, never mind. And wow! Isaiah Perry with the boomstick on the Zach Earth, forcing a fumble. Dang, son. That's the second time that they've gotten the ball to Zach Ertz and they lose the ball because of it. I mean, there's nothing else to say there, but wow. From the, from the rookie middle linebacker of Isaiah Perry, hitting a boomstick on that. Hitting, hitting hard. You know, I mean hard, I meant. Zach Ertz has some of the best carrying probably at the tight end position. And Perry made him fumble. Gonna hit. Oh my god. Yeah, that's how I don't understand how that's on the run. I literally set my feet, but sure. As we miss Tyree Kill, who was wide open. So close. And we hit Sterling Shepard, but it's not an accurate pass. As Kendall. As Kobe Kendall, I want to call him, is having an awful game. He's one for seven on the day, has thrown a pick. Oh, but he can make that throw, and Tyreek, you gotta hold on to that now. Well, we're gonna have to take our three, because Tyreek Hill can't hold on to the ball. So, Rosa's kick is up. And through the uprights, good. We tie up the game with four minutes, 15 seconds left as Ken Chris Kendall needs, or Kobe Kendall, needs to connect on those. He needs to start hitting his guys more and more, and then he'll be good. But right now, he can't hit anyone for his life. That's why I can't wait until he gets 150 drives in him. Because... I mean, great, because then he would have a depth trait, and that's going to be a big one. Never mind, that's going to be Mick Warren Jr. with the tackle to hold them to only an eight-yard gain. That could have been so much more, but this is probably a pitch play now. So their play action on pitch play. Or a RPO, as Alshon Jeffrey just shrugs off Kendall Floor like he's nothing. Nice. All right, guys, come on, we gotta do something here. They're driving right now. Number 19 is going to be wide open, which is on a street route. And he isn't, but he is on a crosser route, and Dudley Little, I tried to jump the route, but couldn't get enough speed on it. I couldn't get the ball even out of his hands, really. As the Eagles are putting together a drive right here. They're going to target Zach Ertz. And oh my god, what was that garbage animation that put me in? That should have been a pick. I knew exactly who they were targeting. I knew that they were going to Zach Ertz, but puts me in a bad animation. And Zach Ertz with the first down and a big game. Nice hit by Kirkland. Kirkland forces a fumble. Let's go. Isaiah Perry on the recovery as the, there is just under a minute and that was a great time to choose to force a fumble. And then we throw a pick. Oh my god, Corey Coleman, you gotta jump in front of that man. Wow, so instantly we turn over the ball again. Kendall can't find a target right now because the Eagles are locking up. As this is just bad, bad game for both the quarterbacks. Miles Jack his second pick of the game and takes that one down to the 46 yard line. Easy reads on my end. And this has just been an awesome game for quarterbacks apparently. Cause I mean, Tyree Kill hasn't been able to hold on to the ball. Cause we hit Saquon, Saquon should be able to do something here. 
and gets a three yard gain, I want to say. No, five yard gain, actually. This is just about an awful game. I mean, I mean when can we hit Sterling Shepard up for a pass, and that's the first completion of the day for more than a first by Kendall in this game. As number 71, Hernandez, what are you doing? That's a touchdown if he picks a right block and the block, but no, he wants to go say hello to the guy that's already getting blocked. Like, well, what are you doing? And Kendall goes down for a sack, and that's going to be our second time out of the quarter. I mean, I know that we have time left, but still, don't want to risk it. We shouldn't clock, and then we don't get anything out of it. And we're just going to hit up. Evan Ingram right there, and we are probably just gonna let the clock run out, and then uh, we might kick it. And why aren't we running slants in general? Like, why is that not a play that we could run? We're in the red zone. Okay? Oh my God! We had Tyree kill wide open for a touchdown. Yeah, we're just going to kick it in. I'm gonna just call timeout with six seconds left in the clock as Kendall is getting beat up in the pocket. No wonder he's having a bad game. He's not getting any time to breathe in there, really. That should be a perfect kick right down the middle, and it is. We, we only have two seconds on the clock. We're just gonna split it so there's no real chance of them doing anything with it. And Rosa is on the kickoff, and that's a squib. And the big boy gets it. Has, has going to be uh, Thomas with the big tackle. And now we need to actually do something here. We need to score a touchdown and pretty much to seal the fate of these Philadelphia Eagles. I mean, this has been an awful game from both sides of, at the quarterback position. Carson Wentz. Two picks to Miles Jack and Tom um, fumbled by Mr. Zach Earth. As Tyree Kill gets wide open, that's going to be a touchdown. No one was on Tyree Kill. That's going to be a touchdown. Giants take the lead by more than a field goal this time. Let's go, guys. We take the lead by, should be 10 after this kick, and the kick is up, and through the upright, good. We go up 13 to three. Kendall, Kendall picks up a time free kill for a 71-yard gain on a 71-yard touchdown pass. Which is huge, really. I'm just happy that we finally scored a touchdown on these Eagles. They have been playing pretty bad really the whole game. I mean, I'm Zach, I'm Carson Wentz has had an awful game. And Isaiah Perry wanted another hit stick on to Zach Ertz, but that's not happening when he has max security. I mean, Carson Wentz would be perfect right now, but he threw two picks to Miles Jack. So he's not perfect. Oh no. Oh no. Nice job. <laughs> nice job, Dudley Will, to hold on to um, a big rush, but holds them to the six yard line. Oh god, this is a cool special, isn't it? <laughs> No! Oh my god, Miles Jack got in my way. I was reading that so well. Ah, uh, Zach Ertz hit in the end zone touchdown. Eagles. I mean, Zach Ertz really didn't deserve that. I was going to take it off, but sure. That just sucks. Because I would have been able to pick that off. I know I would have been able to, but I got caught on someone. So I wasn't able to. That hurts. Let's go, Corey Coleman. Let's go. Corey Coleman, it's tackle at the 27-yard line. It was worth taking it out. We got two extra yards. Which is literally a take on Barkley. Yeah. All right, I need everyone to just walk who I want them to, and they did not walk who I want them to. I wanted the center to go straight up middle. I wanted the wide receivers to walk outside, dude. And that didn't happen, obviously. 
as Saquon Barkley with a two yard gain on me. And we're gonna hit Preston Williams as he gets popped up in the air and goes down hard. But with no catch on the play. We're just going to actually run double slants here. Just to give us a better chance at getting it first. And we hit Preston Williams up and he holds on to it. Pin heavy coverage and he, as soon as he got the ball, he got destroyed. We don't feel power or smoke. And we're going to run it with Saquon and no, I mean I should have ran to the outside. Saquon with a one yard game. We're going to try to run it middle again. I'm going to try to punch it up with uh, Saquon. And literally no one holds a block. That's going to be Fletcher Cox with the sack and with the tackle after a one yard game for Saquon. Saquon's getting like no progression right now because no one is letting him get open and that is an airmail pass by Kendall as he's had a better game, I guess. Oh uh, yeah, and Riley Dixon, Dixon doesn't have a good leg, so we'll just kick that off. Uh, Kicks it into the end zone, probably should put a little less power on it, but it's fine. And we need a big play right here. They're probably going to keep the ball in the air with Zach Ertz with his ability. And Miles Jack with a big hit. And Isaiah Perry on the, on the fumble recovery has one goal. Oh no, it's L Perry. I thought it was Isaiah Perry. No, I'm wrong. I think it might be a little Lorenzo Perry. But what a big hit stick right there from Miles Jack to force the ball out of Zachary's hands. Dang, son, calm down. Why, um, I'm confused why Saquon's not in, but it doesn't matter. Corey Coleman, his first touchdown, <laughs> sent at, I mean, after since he's torn his AC, no, completely torn his MC. That's going to be shame. That is frustrating. I am, wow. That's the second extra point he's missed so far. Well, both of them were my fault. My long shot. So shut up, announcer. But Miles Jack, better than the player of the week history, because he has popped Zach Ertz, he's picked off Carson Wentz twice. Oh no. Nice hit by Isaiah Perry to get Zach Ertz out of bounds with Kirkland, the rookie surrounding Zach Ertz, just pounced him. I want to go play zone for now. Run play, oh never mind, I got beat the crap out of him. Nice job by Kirkland to force that ball out. That was a touchdown to our Greg Nav, Whiteside, however you pronounce his last name or first name or whatever. Well, that's a touchdown to him, and they run inside zone, and that's going to be Sanders' first big game, really, of the day. He really, yeah, that's his first first down, I think, of today. So, oh my god, why isn't Perry out? Perry's tired. Perry's tired. Nice hit by Jabril Peppers. I don't know how Mike Sanders pulled on to that ball as he just got destroyed by Jabril Peppers. It would have been great if we could force a fourth fumble out. But well, we did. Because uh, that's going to be Kendall, Kendall Fuller yoinking the ball, kicking off Carson Wentz. Yet again, our defense has been performing today. And Kendall, when he gets time in the pocket, has been too. As Saquon Barkley goes down and literally as soon as he touches the ball. Great defense by the Philadelphia Eagles as they were former Super Bowl champs. Not too long ago, actually. 
Did Saquon, did he get the first? No. He did not. He definitely We're stacking the box right now. I'm just going to get inside. The boat, so. Oh my Jesus. I turn it. It's fourth and inches. We got to go for it. Well, the quarterback sneak. We should essentially get this. If we all hold our blocks. Good job. Kendall gets the first down. We are not running out of play ever. Because he was so late getting that over. And Saquon just has not been able to get anything going today. He's just been getting pounded. And like, we've been giving him the rock a lot, but he's not been able to do anything with it because he keeps getting destroyed as soon as he touches the ball. And we have Preston Williams wide open on an out route, but we get no time in the pocket. And that's going to be a third and long for us. And Sterling Shepard can't hold on to it, and we can't make the tackle. That's going to be a big game. And Preston Williams, thank God he's there to make the tackle. Oh my God, that's so dumb how literally every time they, the CPU can pop the ball up in the air. But we need to get another pick here, cause, you know. No way, oh my God, that's so stupid. Miles Jack, why don't you turn around and try to catch the ball? Don't try to tackle him. Like, what are you doing, man? Well, great. We get screwed over out of another thing as Zach Ertz gets his second touchdown of the day. Um, that's just frustrating. And Carson Wentz has been nearly flawless today. I mean, besides Stu Kick. Should have been number four. That would have been a game for Miles Jack. But hopefully we can just keep scoring. I mean, Kendall can't just throw the ball away. I can't just throw the ball like that for the rest of the game. I mean, we should be fine. And Saquon literally has zero blocking. I tried to cut out the middle because there was a hole. And then all of a sudden that hole closes almost immediately. I don't even know why we want to play action with the pressure that we've been getting thrown at us as Evan Ingram goes up and mosses his man. I thought that was going to be picked. That was a really dumb pass on my end. But somehow they didn't intercept it. Jesus Christ, I really wish thank one who would get some blocks because he is getting nothing right now. These eagles are just shredding through, shedding everything, really. And we're going to do a up to Saquon, and he gets tackled. And he, um, he gets hit hard as soon as he gets the ball and loses it, of course. But we just can't let anything else bad really happen in this game, and that's a risky pass as Sterling Shepard cannot make the grab. We are going to have to, you know, I, just, I need to go for it. If we don't get it here, then we're in trouble. Because I don't feel like our, I mean, our defense has made stops today, but a perfect throw by, uh, by Kendall. You can say that that's a bad throw game all you want, but that was a perfect one. You put it right over everyone's side. And we hit up Sterling Shepard in stride to get that gets us down to the 15 yard line. We are starting to do something on offense, finally. We're going to try to mix it up and put up a run play to the other side this time. And that's going to be a face mask call. And that's going to close down. It should be the one. Defense. We're at the 15, and now that puts us down at the 5. Ready, ready! Dirty base! Saquon breaks off 1 and gets us down to the 1. No, I would like 
chance to do formations on my own play. I'm going to go to the same. And Bowman's in, Bowman checks in because we don't want Saquon out there for whatever reason. And let Ellington, 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 what the heck was that? That was the wimpiest, that was the wimpiest block attempt I have ever seen from anyone in this game, really. Sterling Shepard stays in, touchdown, the Giants. Let's go, Sterling Shepard. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Booth review, this should be a touchdown. If it's not, then I'll be sad, and it is a touchdown. They're just going to kick a field goal to go up by nine. Don't give them any shots at coming back in this game. This could be our first win of the season. First win in a while since week two of last year. It's been a year since we've gotten a win. Let's see if we can break the curse of no wins. As we force a fumble on the kick return. Oh my God. Wow. That is huge. We could go up by even more you now if we don't do anything stupid as nice job by Tyreek Hill to just reach his arms out and just go. We could win a game. They should be in covered. As Saquon gets the first down. He's had an awful game, but you know what? He's been coming up huge when we need him to. And, yeah. And Brett Ellingson needs to pick up a block on the inside man, but it's fine. Take on Barker for our gain. This should take us into two minute warning, as it does. No chop, no, yeah, no clock is going to shoot. In this, in this play right here because the net warning stops the clock. And this could be our first win since last year, of course, as Saquon Barkley says, no, 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 I want to touch down on this play. Big, big rush by Saquon finally finds a gap, and then he gets in the end zone, and they want us to go for two for whatever reason. I mean, sure. I'm down. And no blocks. Shocker. My shots? No, not really. And I think it was um number 53 who forced the ball out last time on a big hit. And yeah, they, what do you have to tell your guy after they pretty much so sold out the game? We're going to man coverage. We want to pick with anyone on this play. If Warren though, is having a tough task of being on Zach Ertz as he tests McLaurin and McLaurin with the pick. And what a grab by Mike McLaurin Jr. That's his first pick in the NFL. What a pick from the rookie. For second year. But I don't know why the Eagles would even call timeouts at this point. The game's over, guys. Come on. As the Giants, if everything goes right here, we should pick up our first win of the season, our first win in two in a year. A fake on Barkley with another big rush of 13 right up the middle. And our first down marker is up the two-yard line. We're going to fake the and we're going to fake a run and go RPO slant. And we hit Tyreek Hill, touchdown Giants. No illegal man downfield, nothing. That's a clean touchdown for us. Let's go, Giants rule. You suck. Finally, we get a dog on our side on all matters. And that was due to perfect users in today's video, and that's going to be the one who's on the tackle. Not like Nigel, not, not, yeah, Nigel Bradham go anywhere past where he caught the ball at. But great job by our team, really, of doing all this. I did not think that we would be able to do that. And no, I think it may have been Lorenzo Carter who forced the fumble, actually. Because he laid, someone laid their full body. I'm happy. 
Well, yeah, we're going to use a Miles Jack. They're going to crop. Oh my god. Suddenly, when he just got burned. Final play, and then he Okay, why are they playing together to drive all of a sudden? I mean, the game's over, so I don't care. But still, like, why? And I wanted to pick with Dudley Will. Oh, he dropped it. I wanted to pick with Dudley Will so bad, but I couldn't get it. And let's go, boys. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, well, I mean, how is he not running out of bounds, first off? And why did this stop the clock? Did they say he was out of bounds? Boy, this said that he was out of bounds. That guy just had a great game, I mean, but he's just been part of the team. Nice. Okay, guys. Nice hit by Kirkland, though, after the catch. But how do we not pick that off? That's like a literal just prayer in the middle of the end zone. I don't even think he was aiming for anyone. I think he just threw it. <laughs> but they kick a field goal. They're probably going to do an onside kick. Like, the game's over, guys. Fine, we'll put together one last good drive on your guys' side if you want us to. I don't care. And Wayne Gallman Jr. on the, on the pickup. Oh, my God. He could have taken the onside kick back to the house. Let's Coleman and Junior broke off two. I want to go to this side. Oh, never mind, it's on the third side. And that's going to be a timeout for Schmeagles. And the game's over, so I just, I just throw one more pass. See if we can get a touchdown. See if we can get Saquon over Steven <laughs> Touchdown as well. Oh, well that's a dumb idea because that's picked off, but that's fine. We're at the three. Gives us another chance to pick them off. I like... It would pinch, but there's no point in really doing that. So we're just going to bring the blitz and Miles back and yeah, he's going to come back. Oh my god, that's a cannon. Hope they have one more shot. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to try to get picked by the Jack. Using one, using one as a middle linebacker, which would be very lucky. Stay behind everyone, real quick, Miles. And go up for it. Aw. No one even catches the ball on a Hail Mary, like in this game ever, so. That's why I just run four verts if I'm in a situation like that, because Hail Marys never work. Unless you get lucky, then they work. But yeah, Miles and Jack have a game. With three, with, <laughs> yeah, we had eight takeaways on them. Carson Wentz threw five picks, I want to say. No, four. And then rushing, we forced a fumble on the turn. Where was it? Where was it? Where was it? Oh, I can't see fumbles on here. Well, Zach Ertz fumbled twice. I would just like to say that. Yeah, Miles Jack had two picks. And then... Mark McClellan. Oh, never mind. It's his second year in the NFL. But I think that was his first pick anyway. Kendall Fuller had a pick. And yeah. On the return, though, someone fumbled. And I think it was number. Yeah, it was you. <laughs> Bowman could have taken that one back to the house, which would have been sick. But you know what? Good game, nonetheless. As we, ob well, obviously it was a good game. We won a game. I know, big shockers. And it was, a, it was an actual game, too. Marcus Kirkland with an upgrade, let's go. And we're going to put that into hybrid to try to get you faster. Did it work? 
No, it did not. Kirkland, what's your speed anyway? 90. That's okay, I guess. Oh, shoot, yeah, I forgot we had a breakup player. It wasn't the elite performance I was hoping for, blah, 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 blah. Well, Tyus Bowser, I've failed him twice now. I feel bad. But you know what? Whatever. We can get over it. As we will sim to the next week. Let's see if we have anything going on. No, we do not. Dalvin Tomlinson got hurt. Oh, I did. I just play him because I don't care. Alright, well, I'm going to end the video off here. Hope you guys enjoyed, and yeah, bye.